Super Sunrise is battling away. Race one, come on. Royal Mare at the moment can't get past because Super Sunrise has found plenty. Super Sunrise from Royal Mare. Royal Mare tries to battle back and is doing so on the near side now. Royal Mare beginning to get up close home. Royal Mare gets there. And denies Super Sunrise and a good finish between the two. Clear of Higgs in third. And then came Eid. For six result then Hooper Hearts is number... Five Royal Mare out for one race number eight shoot six and second number nine eight seventeen thirty number three hey eight would four and fourth number four has two acute five and fifth seven and two think Swiggy London makes a mistake and tumbles two race hopefully horse and rider are okay in second place now is Parikama but it's Idagem leading by about six lengths, not doing much in front at all. Being chased by Parikama, who is finishing strongly. Idagem idling badly in front. Can Parikama get to Idagem? Idagem needs the line desperately, and Parikama looks to have got it from Idagem. And they are clear of the third horse, Tampico Rock. For six years old, then Hooper Horse is number six. Parikama mode two, one race number two. It there gain out three and second number five with Tom Picaro code chooser one and third. Think. Get the better of Hunter Race three. Johnny Mack just about in front and getting the measure of his rival. Three wins in a row for Johnny Mack stays on to win. From Hunter Legend in second. Close for third. Clona Kilty who stayed on again with Harel du Marais. And they were clear of Lime Tree. For seven here is old and Hooper Hearts is number six. Johnny Mack OD5 won the race and number five Hunter Legend due to two and second. Number four with five and third and number three. Harold Dumara is with six and fourth. Number two, Limetri Boy with ten and fifth. Number one, hold three four. I think. Dominic's fault though is trying to get up to the center of the course and he's running on strongly now. Don, uh, Dominic's fault. Wow Bucks has the rail on the near side. Not much between them. It's Dominic's fault on the far side. Wow Bucks tries to battle back, but Dominic's fault is on top. Dominic's fault will win for Gavin Sheen and or five here is old and who part horses number two dominic's fault would four one race number seven wow books would three and second number four julie scribe out seven and third number one tommy gun would three and fourth number three would eight and number five would five one five one Thank you guys. Macarlo comes to the five race. Measures it well and jumps about seven, eight lengths clear. A mistake by Inspiratrice in second. Then Artemis Kimbo in third place. But Galise Macarlo's jumped really well today. She's staying on strongly for a ch first chasing success. Galise Macarlo eased down by Peter Summers towards the line. Galise Macarlo is the winner and she does it very nicely indeed. Gets a good pat down the side. From in second place, Inspiratrice. And then. Our five here is Odin, who part the horses. Number one, Galaxy Macalo Ode two, one race number four, Ode two and second number three, Ode two and thirty. Thank you guys. Six in the last race. A driving finish, Robbers Bridge. Billy the Real Big Red, though, is finding plenty towards the near side. Billy the Real Big Red trying to get past Robbers Bridge. There's nothing between the two. Billy the Real Big Red and Robbers Bridge desperately tight. Side by side, wall very close. Billy the Real Big Red and Robbers Bridge in a tight finish. It's very close to the last. Harry for four heroes old and who part horses. Number 12. Old six, one's race and number 13. Old four and second, number three. Old fifteen and third and number nine. Old three and fourth, number six. Old twelve and fifth. Five and seven, fourteen, eight, four, ten and eleven. Thank you guys. Hello. Thank for watching my video until the end. Sign up to receive more horse racing videos. I am Matheus and see you next time.